Hey, it's Brett Click here from brettclicker.com and the undergroundworkoutmanual.com. Welcome to today's five minute time tamer for people whose knees hurt. I get that all the time, Brett, I have bad knees so I can't exercise, wrong. I'm here in my street clothes with no space, no equipment. I'm gonna show you how to exercise even if your knees hurt. We're gonna start in place right here with side kicks. So I'm gonna kick up to the side right here, right above I'm right in the corner here, right by my desk. I'm kicking up above my desk. Now, if your legs can't get that high or if they can get much higher, go ahead and give it a try. You'll notice I'm wearing jeans and a t-shirt. I don't even have shoes on, I don't have socks on. It doesn't matter what you're wearing or where you're at, there's always that opportunity to get fit. So again, kicking up to the side, side to side, give it a couple more kicks and relax. Next, we're gonna move on to Frankenstein reaches and kicks. These are gonna work on balance and flexibility. So I'm gonna reach, forward on one leg as far as I can and then kick up at the top. I'm going to reach forward and then kick. I'm balancing so I'll show you from the side a little bit. You want to reach to where that leg, I'm going to try to lift it above the desk, gets flat behind you and then kick it up. So again, I'm here, kick it up. Balance reach, kick that leg, I'm working on that balance, don't let that knee shake. The foot is probably going to burn a little bit, my butt might burn a little bit. That's good, your calves might even be burning a little bit. Really reach it out and kick it up the top. I'm gonna to go to the next leg. Now, if you have knee problems, it's gonna reach out. A lot of that, if you haven't had surgery or you just have kind of general knee pain, it could be because of weak hips. Something going on in and around those hips has caused that knee instability and that knee pain. So believe it or not, this type of work can actually help solve, not just can you do it with knee problems, you can actually help solve your knee problems. Again, wearing street clothes. You're gonna really kick it up, reach it out. You're gonna give me about three more. One, two, and one more. Fire it up, and three, good. So that's both legs, get him going. Next, we're gonna go on down to the ground. So it's gonna be here, just like this. I'm gonna go a push up and knee under. So I'm gonna push up, Bring my knee under my body and up, and then switch. Push up, knee goes under the body and switch. Push up. What this does, is it kind of gets our ab muscles involved with the whole motion. Come down, rotate up. Come down, rotate up. You can feel that through your trunk, working hard, just like that. Again, getting my heart rate up, getting working, even if my knees hurt. All right, sit back. Stretch those arms a little bit. Now I'm gonna go swimming. I'm gonna bend my legs up, but I want you to keep them straight. It's cause I'm in a little corner here. I'm gonna reach those arms out and I'm gonna swim. So my hands don't touch the ground. Really reach it out and up. Bring the elbow up like you're swimming. Keep your feet on the ground. Again, I just have mine up so you can see this whole motion. Really get it up and reach. Up and over, reach forward. If you have bad upper body posture, like I do, even though I work on it. This is gonna be something that's very difficult. You're gonna feel your upper back burn a little bit. That's fine. It means you're working. And relax. Nice job. Next, these are called cliff scalers. So I'm gonna keep my feet in place. I'm gonna put my hands out. I'm gonna go one, two, three to my left. One, two, three to my right. Together, one, two, three to my left. One, two, three to my right. Moving side to side, great shoulder stability. It's probably gonna burn a little bit. My abs are tight. You can always go to your knees if you have to on this. One side, together, and then the other side, and together, and relax, stretch it out. Next, we're gonna go to a plank and rotate. So I'm gonna go on to my elbows. I'm gonna be here just like this on those elbows, nice flat back. I'm going to rotate up, shoulder blades together, rotate back down. I'm going to rotate up and back down. Really try to line your body up, pinch those shoulder blades back, and come back down. Come up, rotate, line it up, and come back down. Again, doesn't matter what you're wearing, doesn't matter where you're at, there's always an opportunity to get better, even if your knees hurt. Pinch it together and down, pinch it together and come down. Nice job. Last and not least, these are crab raises. These are the opposite of what we do in the desk all day, so they're great for us too. 
So I'm going to sit down, I'm going to raise up and hold it at the top. Notice how I'm flat, squeeze my glutes, come down, touch your butt to the ground, come back up, squeeze your glutes. My arms stay straight, come up, pinch those glutes. Again, great posture exercise, makes our glutes work, gets our lower body involved without demands on the knees. We don't want pain. We can always exercise without pain. Nice job. So again, there's about five minutes of exercise that we can do, even if your knees hurt. Go and repeat that circuit. If you want to burn fat, let's look at repeating that circuit anywhere from three to four times, even more than that. You just want to improve your energy, you just want to get your blood going, just do it once. So again, for this and hundreds of other exercises to improve your life, to get you fit, to burn fat, go to www.undergroundworkoutmanual.com or www.brettclicker.com. So again, thanks for coming out for the five minute time tamer. I look forward to seeing you soon. Share the word. Let's spread the word to get people moving. Have a great day. I hope to see you soon.